talking about shopping and my current hobby it's collecting final and i think i also mentioned this in my last vlog i already bought like three other final from taylor swift and olivia's sour album but i bought them off of a reseller so they're a little bit more expensive and it takes a long time for them to arrive but finally a package has arrived and i know what it is it's wait Taylor Swift's Evermore album which I'm so excited about I've been waiting for this for two or three months and I got the green final edition I don't think I got the original green one from her website because I know there are a lot of different green final edition a more opaque one translucent one but I think I got the translucent one because I didn't get this from her website I got this I I think from either Walmart or Target. I think Walmart has the green one because Target edition is red which I don't like because I don't think the red fit this album or even folklore so I'm glad I got the green edition. So, so now let's just unbox this. Okay so this is the album. I'm so excited to finally have this on my hand because I like I cannot wait to listen to this album on final. I haven't been able to stop listening to this album since it came out. Like I love this album even more than folklore. I think I listen to this album like way more than folklore. I don't know what it is about this album, but it's just like folklore is an incredible album, but this one for some reason it gets better and better with each listen and I don't know how that's possible because at first listen I already love this but the more I listen to it the more I love it and I can't wait to listen to this album on my record player because I know this will be the type of album that sounds amazing on final I just have a hunch folklore also sounds incredible on final by the way especially August Ugh, August and Lacey the Fair also sounds incredible on final By the way, my favorite song from this album, ugh, difficult question, I don't know if I can choose, but I think in my top 3 it's Champagne Problems, This The Damn Season, and I think Evermore, but I love the whole album. So this is the iconic cover. By the way, if you haven't noticed, since Taylor moved to Republic and owned her albums on the Masters, she didn't put her name on the cover anymore. I think In Lover also has Lover on the cover, but I don't think she put her name. Obviously, Folklore and Evermore doesn't even have the title of the album. Same thing with Fearless and Red Taylor's version, and I think that's pretty iconic. And this is the back of it. So this is a gatefold which I love because it's like finally it's expensive. I spent a lot of money to buy them. So when it's a gatefold or a trifold or whatever, there's something special in it and I feel like that's worth my money even more. Just two beautiful pictures of Taylor. I really love this picture. It looks very cool and like very peaceful. The vibe of this album is so superior. So this is the first side. It has all the lyrics and the credits of each song.
by the way, I can already tell that this sleeve will be as bad as the folklore one. I don't know what it is. Lover doesn't have this problem, so I know the problem is only with her recent two albums. I don't know if Fearless will be like this, but the inner sleeve for folklore and also this one I can tell is pretty bad. Like the material of the inner sleeve is pretty thin. It's already ripping. I don't know if you can see that. Like, I don't know if ripping is it even a word. And my folklore inner sleeve is already very beat up. Like it's already ripped all along the edges, bottom and each side. I don't know if it's the quality of the paper or is it the final itself. Maybe the edges is a bit like rough or something. So they kind of cut through the paper. A lot of other albums usually don't have that problem. I think someone has to bring these problems to Taylor's attention so we can do something about that for the future albums. Uh, it's new so it's kind of sticks to the paper but I will put a, another plastic inner sleeve. So as you can see I got the translucent green final. In some light it looks kind of like emerald green in sunlight i'm pretty sure it will look even brighter we are inside so it, it looks a little bit darker but in my eye it looks very bright but in camera in some lights it kind of looks way more jeweled emerald kind of green which i really like it's gorgeous i really like the green with this album like it fits perfectly and i think the original green like the first pressing from taylor's website it's kind of rare so if any of you have this album and you got that green, congratulations. <laughs> but wait a minute, I'm just going to grab my inner and outer sleeve first so it will be safer for the final. This is an inner sleeve, an anti-static inner sleeve. So it will protect your final even better because this paper sleeve thing will cause a lot of static to your final and also in the long run, it will probably scratch your final more. then just put them back inside the inner sleeve so hopefully with this plastic it won't rip as bad as my folklore one so let's see the other side obviously it's see this already ripped even worse than the other one it's already like destroyed <laughs> pretty much kind of badly Thank god it's only on one side but it's pretty bad and as you can see I just opened this with you guys so I'm pretty sure it's the issues is with the paper itself from the manufacturer. Ugh. Why? Oh, as you can see that. So the other one, the sleeve looks like this. Another beautiful pictures of Taylor in the woods. And the rest of this, just a full page of the lyrics. Season right this time in my hometown. 